magic of getting together is very important for us. So the goal is very simple. Let important conversations and the magic and unexpected happen. Having these in-person events is so, so important because that energy that we all create together when we share ideas, when we debate things, when we go a little bit deeper into some of the conversations around decentralization, privacy, and a whole host of different topics, it's what makes this move forward and it's what makes this evolve. When people get together and talk and get to understand stuff deeper, then it just helps generate new ideas as well. And it, it helps Ethereum keep innovating. I think this is like a really special energy that you don't see in a lot of places. You can go to an event and find people from all over the world with different skill sets, different interests, and I think most importantly, different ways of contributing to the protocol. A lot of relevant governors with a lot of DAO experience have gotten together here, for may, many of them for the first time, and they get to spend time together. And this hopefully will catalyze a processes that need like social bond, social viscosity to come through. Events important to us just because we never see these people in real life. So our community, we're the biggest community of Web3 developers in the world. Like, just being able to see 165 projects come in a short amount of time in so many different categories from L2s to NFTs to DAOs to core infrastructure and developer tooling. Bringing those people together now and making sure that they feel like they have the support or they feel like getting the feeling that they belong is what these events are designed for. We have the opportunity to really rethink and reimagine how we interact financially, socially, and from a digitally native perspective. Community feeling, uh, the aspect of how we work together all around the world, not even seeing each other, you know, being in the same office. So that is very unique. The whole decentralized aspect applies uh, fundamentally to the layer zero, to the community layer. I really don't want to forget the, the fundamentals that are powering this industry, privacy, ownership, uh, self-sovereignty. And I want to make sure that whatever we're building with Ethereum, with crypto, with Web3, uh, that those fundamentals are upheld and that users are truly empowered and own their keys, their data, and, uh, and that they're at the center of the future that we're building for financial freedom. We need to continue to figure out ways to make the protocol better, uh, make it more scalable, make it more sustainable, more secure. All of these things are important for not just the protocol itself abstractly, but for the people that use it. So this event specifically is getting all of these layer one researchers and con contributors to clients together and getting them on the same page in terms of what do we want to work on, what is important, where are we going next. So really staking is at soon to be at the core functionality of the entire Ethereum network. And there are various things that we need to pay attention to with respect to keeping Ethereum decentralized. Ethereum can continue to grow and blossom as a platform that's more democratized, I think, than ever with L2s, but only if the core principles are met. More people now understand the different trade-offs facing L2s, and then more people can use this knowledge for the betterment of the L2s and the Ethereum ecosystem as a whole. Technology should just be developed in a way that's as open as possible and that people should have equal access to things. There's a lot of opportunity for, for, for the general public, for the cultural workforce, for the cultural community in general, to actually maybe create alternatives to the systems that we currently have. It brings so much freedom to our lives and it's like incredible for me to like see the opportunities that Ethereum brings us. Ethereum is a shelling point for the hopeful. It's a place where activists and entrepreneurs and thoughtful people can come together and build new systems. We want to create new institutions that represent our values, upgrade democracy for web scale, build a financial system that's more oriented around our values. And Ethereum is a place where we have the tools and we have the ethos to make that happen. Take the green pill and on. I don't think there's another community out there in which people are shipping, innovating, and thinking at this pace, and that's really exciting to be part of. If I have found someone who is into Ethereum, usually we can become friends and get along. It feels like home, a distributed home. 
the energy is like huge and you can feel how passionate these people are. It will change the world. I'm very happy that the ETH community is more open. I mean, it's one of the biggest communities. It's, it does so many amazing events around the world. The Ethereum community is full of very like optimistic and forward looking people and uh, it's like very refreshing. It is the most fun research community and it's the most intellectually rewarding and it's the most open and I, and I just love working in this community and, and contributing. Every time I contribute, I receive 10x uh, what I put in and I think it's a, it's a wonderful feeling. This is an open community that's accepting of all people and that's really important to me because if you can accept all people and that they feel safe and then they can build and create things that are open for other people to also feel safe and create what they want. The Ethereum community has been really, really important to my growth and it will be important to the future growth of Herdow. This is above and beyond what we thought an event would be. For us, it's a part of giving back and it's a part of really seeing Ethereum grow and blockchain grow and really spread the idea of blockchain and Ethereum to the world. All the hard work we've put in over the past four years just really come to fruition in an event like this. See how happy students coming out of it are and how thankful they are meeting up with alumni of our boot camps and you know them thanking us of us helping them get jobs. I really enjoy the decentralized uh, values. It's a growing uh, ecosystem worldwide. It's a growing community and I would love to be a part of it. And I'm not a developer myself but this is a way for me to give back. It's so really important to the Ethereum community to like, have these gatherings where we just come together with sort of the open mind to, to see what comes out of it. I think a lot of the biggest sort of innovations that have happened in the Ethereum space have happened by accident because people were just in the right place at the right time with the right energy. We need to talk to each other, we need to work together. As long as people can learn from each other and connect in real life, we haven't had that for so long.